Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Mind Your Exam. In this video, we will learn how to compute the frequency of the given data based on the given bin values and we will also compute the histogram for the given data. So to do so, you must have the data analysis tool pack installed or downloaded in this MS Excel and to do so you can check the video that I have shared at the right hand side and also in the description box. So once you have added the data analysis tool pack, click on the data tab, go to the extreme right and click on data analysis. Now in the dialog box that appears, you will see multiple options. Double click on the histogram option. A new dialog box will appear. In this dialog box, you have to input two particular values. The first is the input range. Now in the input range, you have to select the input values for which you have to calculate the frequency depending on the bin values. And in the second input cell, you have to provide the bin values. Now bin values are these 10, 30, 50, 70 and 90. Now since I have not provided any labels, so I will not tick mark this checkbox. Also the output should be in the same sheet. So I am selecting a cell in front of output range and I am clicking on one cell in the existing sheet where I want the result then you can press on ok but if you want the result in a new worksheet or in a new workbook completely then you can select the second or the third option respectively I want the result in the same sheet so I click on ok and as you do so a bin frequency table will be generated but here the chart has not been generated this is because we have not clicked the chart output option. So to click or to display the chart, you will have to go to the histogram and also tick mark the last option which is the chart output. Click on OK and then you will get the result both the bin, the bin frequency table as well as the histogram. Okay. Now in this bin frequency table, you can see these bin values are the same as what I provided as the input. Okay, so the frequency corresponding to each bin value is for bin value 10. That means the numbers in this particular range which lie between 0 and 10 are 0 in number. So there are no numbers which lie in the range 0 to 10. Then there are three numbers which lie in the range 11 to 30 then there are five numbers which lie in the range 31 to 50 and so on and this you can see in the histogram also where you can see the frequency values corresponding to each bin range okay so this is all about bin frequency and histogram i hope you have understood the concept and how to calculate it thank you for watching till we meet in the next video and your exam